with meteorologist Kelly Foster. We have made it to Friday, but we are in the risk zone for severe weather. We are also under code red tonight all the way through tomorrow morning. Here's why we could be looking at spin up thunderstorms that could produce tornadoes. We're under a tornado watch until 9 o'clock. Mobile, Baldwin, Washington, Clark, Green, and George County, Mississippi. Also Mobile Bay, Escambia Bay, and adjacent waters. So primary threats with this weather maker will be a few tornadoes damaging wind gusts up to 60 miles per hour, large hail, and the potential for flooding. So much of the NBC 15 neighborhood still under this level two out of five risk in yellow. Level one are beach zones in green, and all of this will shift east as we head to tomorrow morning. Right now that level two will be east of Destin, and the level one we will cover Okaloosa County. Here's a look at the radar scan right now. We're not tracking any severe weather across our area, but we are seeing some flash flood warnings off to the west in Mississippi near Sand Hill, Perry County. Also, we've seen that in Lauderdale County, but we are under a, um, a flood warning for the uh, Washington County area due to the fact that they've collected several inches of rain in short order. And of course, they could be looking at more as these thunderstorms are slow to move from west to east. Also, a few showers moving up Highway 45 in Clark County. There's a look at those flash flood warnings. And again, all this is going to be moving our way. Take a look at the beach zones right now. Things are quiet. Still some steady rain over Mobile County and a few thunderstorms moving over Crestview within the next 15 minutes. There's the forecast tracker and you can see we're still going to be looking at thunderstorms that could unleash heavy rain. Again, we are expecting two to four inches of rain, possibly six inches in some isolated spots around one o'clock in the morning. More thunderstorms. These are going to come in rounds. The first round with active weather in between now and 10 o'clock. Another round in between midnight and about 8 a.m. There's a look at 530 in the morning. Crestview over to Destin. Still some coastal thunderstorms and then we're done. Take a look at the rainfall tracker and you can see northern Clark County near Grove Hill could see about three inches of rain when we work our way southward. Mobile about a half an inch and less than a quarter of an inch for our beach zone. So we are under flood watch for our inland counties until 6 a.m. tomorrow morning. So rain coverage will be at 50 percent. The risk of severe storms not a guarantee, but on the table. We're springing forward on Sunday, so Saturday night before you go to bed. You will lose an hour of sleep, set the clocks ahead an hour. No rain Sunday and on Wednesday afternoon. We're going to toss in about a 10% chance of a shower. There's your seven day tracker. Hi, today 75. Again, code red tonight through tomorrow morning. And then we will be looking at highs in the mid 70s tomorrow, mid 60s on Sunday, and only stray showers Wednesday through Friday.